my name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is It is the last story. It is like a revising story. God's good news. Be part of the story. This is the story about what we have read. In the beginning, God made everything. He made it perfect. He made us too. And his image. So he loved us and wants to have a relationship with us. So God, in the beginning, God made the whole world. And made everything like and there was no sun. It is like a heaven. Yes, no the Bible again. Patient. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, and gentleness and self control. Suddenly, Adam and Eve disobeyed God. That sun brought that into the world and broke our relationship with God. It also broke God's perfect world. So God wanted to have a relationship with us, so He made us in His image. But one day, suddenly Adam and Eve disobeyed God and from that time we were in our heart there was sense. Sun spear spread throughout the whole world everyone sends Anna and the result of his son is that but sin couldn't stop God from loving us he had a plan so the sin brought spread to everyone in the whole world everyone started to sin and our relationship with God was broken, but sin couldn't stop God from loving us. <laughs> Question: Adam and Eve sin broken our relationship with God too. True. Because of his love for us, God sent his son Jesus into the world. Sin broke in our relationship with God, but Jesus came to fix it. So. Because of his God's love, God sent his son Jesus to us and Jesus has came to fix our relationship with God. <coughs> Jesus healed sick people and performed many other miracles. He welcomed lonely people, and he taught people about God's love. His perfect life shows us what love looks like. So, Jesus healed the sick people and performed many miracles. 
and he welcome Lola Gita. And God, Jesus also loves them. Question, does God ever stop loving us? No. Everyone thought Jesus never, oh sorry, even thought Jesus not, sorry. Even Jesus never said he, dis, he died on the cross for our sins because he loved us by going, I, by doing this. He was crying carrying out God's plan to fix our relationship with him. So every even so Jesus was never Jesus never sinned. But like people said to nail Jesus on the cross and he was carrying out God's plan. <laughs> Gentleness. Three days later, Jesus rose from the dead, breaking the power of sins and death. He spent time with his followers, teaching them they return to heaven. Now, Jesus is alive forever. So three days later, he rose from the dead, breaking the power of sin and death. Now, Jesus will live forever in heaven. Question, God loves us too much so that he sent his only son Jesus to die on the cross for our sins, true? Jesus did not leave us alone. He sent His Holy Spirit to live inside everyone who trusts Him. The Spirit gives us power to live the way God created us to live. So God didn't leave us alone yet. Send the Spirit for us. One day, when Jesus returns, God will make everything perfect again. He will make the new heaven and the new earth. Everyone who trusts in Jesus will live with Him forever. So... Jesus has made heaven. Whoever believes Jesus will go to heaven and live forever. <laughs> there is no sin and death, pain, those things. <laughs> God loves you. He created you one of a kind. Trusting and following Jesus fix our broken relationship with God. Are you ready to be the part of the story? <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Question. One day, everyone who trusts in Jesus will live with him in the heaven. It is the last story. Yes, today we read the Bible story. The day died and next time, I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye!